Justin Timberlake, all out of sync in the Hamptons, arrested for driving while intoxicated. Good stuff. The Prince of Pop, in the thick of his Forget Tomorrow world tour, forgot his designated driver during an outing on Long Island and was pulled over just after midnight on Tuesday. The Can't Stop the Feeling singer was reportedly partying at the American Hotel in Sag Harbor, and when he drove off after, couldn't stop at the first stop sign, which just so happened to be close to the local police station. The cops quickly pulled JT over. He failed a field sobriety test, then refused a breathalyzer, which led to his DWI charge. Justin's lawyer, whose office happens to be in Sag Harbor, told Us Weekly, the charge was a single count because he refused the breath test. Mr. Timberlake was also charged with two other court citations, running a stop sign and not traveling in the correct traffic lane. TMZ says JT's BFFs on the scene tried to talk officers out of the DWI charge, but the cops said, cry me a river, and took Justin into custody. Sources tell the tabloid that the suit and tie crooner claimed he kept it classy and actually only had one drink, telling an officer, I had one martini and I followed my friends home. But Page Six says the Sag Harbor police officer was so young that he didn't even know who Justin was. <laughs> Justin's wife, Jessica Biel, was in New York City hours before his arrest, filming her new Amazon Prime series, The Better Sister. There's been no public comment from the couple regarding the DWI as of the making of this video. On Father's Day, Beale posted about the father of her two children, writing on Instagram, "'You're so many things to so many people, but to us, you are the rock. The rock we climb on, we lean against.'" And Justin captioned a Father's Day post dedicated to his kids, "'I will always be there for you through your peaks and valleys, to lift you up and show you how high you can take this life, and to pick you up when you fall.'" Back in his sexy back era, Justin told The Guardian, "'I'm just like everyone else. I get completely plastered. I've done my fair share of drugs and I've been caught places with my pants down. It's just I make sure there are no cameras around." Justin's recent arrest was captured on police body cam, TMZ reports. But footage showing the Rock Your Body hitmaker failing to stand on one leg has yet to be released. Everybody wants to know, why didn't he just take an Uber? Why didn't he have a driver? Those questions and more could be answered on July 26, when Man of the Woods is due to appear in court, which could interfere with his big tour. Justin is scheduled to appear in concert that day in Poland. There are reports that his concert ticket sales have been lackluster, and his latest solo album received poor reviews, with Pitchfork writing, at 77 minutes, the mercilessly unhurried everything I thought it was does everything you thought Justin Timberlake did but worse. Closing track, Conditions, is about the bad decisions that harm a relationship, with Justin singing at one point, sometimes you gotta put the car in reverse to move forward, gotta make it through the night till you get to the morning. Justin made it through the night, but his bad decision to drink and drive, in a residential neighborhood no less, has fans reevaluating everything they thought he was. With someone like Justin with unlimited resources, there's no excuse to get behind the wheel.